It's pretty new for me because there's a lot of content to remember and um, some parts that I really need to like read it many, many times until I can really, really memorize it. Pharmacology is definitely a lot. Um, it's a lot to remember. The words have a lot of syllables and yeah, most of them. So for most times it requires a lot of reviewing to remember everything. One of the main obstacles to learning pharmacology is the fact that there's just so much content to remember. Um, each drug basically has 10 different things that you need to remember added on to the name of the drug. So you'll have to remember its mechanisms, its indications, its side effects, and like there's 5, 10 different side effects. So it becomes a subject with a lot of content very fast. Um, and so I think that's one of the main obstacles that we had to face while learning. The names are very hard to remember sometimes because sometimes you think oh this group has like a very similar name but then oh no some of them most of them more more of them doesn't really have a similar pattern to remember so you have to really come up with a method um, yourself to like try to like load all, all those information into your head as soon as possible um, it's it's very stressful when you have a little time to memorize so it is very important to find your own style to like get all of those information ready for your exams. Um, after using Pharmatch uh, as like a tool to study pharmacology, I'd say that Pharmatch offers you a lot of kind of opportunities to review because of how easy the game is to play and how little time you need in order to kind of review each drug. Um, I think it provides us with, with this opportunity to just play it all the time. So you can play it while you're eating, play it when you're just free or when you're waiting for something. And so I think that's probably one of the best things about this game and it allows us to go over the same content, the same drugs, the same side effects many, many times. and. Uh, that definitely helped me uh, with my pharmacology. I feel like when you study a lot, and for medical students you indeed study a whole lot, um, sometimes just reviewing lectures can be pretty much gruesome and dire, so maybe like I feel more fun if I just study in game form and just you know fooling myself that I'm playing a game, I'm not studying, and the most like the platform is very cute as well so it makes my mental health a little bit better I guess um, I really like the cards and you know everything essentially yeah and and for sure you can play it anytime you want and you can you know kind of relax while you're studying so that's definitely the good part about Farmatch. Um, when, when you match a drug with its indication, side effects, mechanisms, um, I find it very helpful in like helping the association. Like so, like the more you play it, when I see it, when I see this drug in the exam, I can think up just like that. Like, what 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 other side effects is associated with it, or what what is the one exception for it, or something like that. Um, because definitely, it also has visuals that help you remember. For example, like propofol, green urine. I, I can see the the cards in my head. Um, so yeah, it definitely helped with the with the recall, the instant recall. Um, and 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 it's just it's just something fun to do. Like I still use it even when um, even when I don't have an exam coming on drugs. I can still just just play it day to day and feel like I'm doing something useful like but 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 i but i feel good doing it i feel fun doing it so yeah it's definitely very helpful and a very good game <laughs> uh, a format that is very helpful in studying and medicine in general it takes a lot of reviewing and association like a disease with something so i think this form of game um should definitely if if developed and integrated with some other um, parts of medicine would definitely be very helpful in studying. Overall, I think a tool like this or a game like this is very helpful and very useful in, I think, subjects with content with patterns and things with categories. For example, in 
In pharmacology, we have a drug, and then every single drug has mechanisms, indications, side effects. So when we apply that kind of structure to other subjects with that kind of categories, for example, like microbiology, so we have one kind of microbe, and then that microbe will have, oh, how does it grow on a culture? What disease does it cause? And what drugs do you use on it? Um, when you have these categories for, for, for one topic, I think it becomes very useful for a tool like this. Um, so yeah, I think um, definitely we can expand um, games and tools like this to, to other um, subjects. Um, I think the game, for example, having like a leaderboard and you can see your friends on it and you feel like, like you can make it into a game with your friends and you can be like, dude, I'm so much faster than you. And, and you know, you feel that, you feel that need of like gameplay and yeah, and so, so it makes, it just makes studying fun and yeah, you can, you can play with your friends doing it and it, very nice overall. It's the il illustrations and the, and the art. I really like the, the white little dude with all the side effects. I think it's very cute and uh, I look forward to the new cards and the new illustrations very much. I know this is just one of the little things but I, I just really like it. Um, and this game kind of has all the side effects and you can have two or three uh, drugs with the same side effects in your game and you can kind of still drag it into those 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 like drugs and it's very helpful to distinguish which side effects belong to which drugs. Yeah. In second year, to be honest, I did not really understand the rule of the game. But it's okay but but I got it like one day playing it so at first I was very confused about the rule of the game so I struggled a little bit. But in third year I got more used to it and then I feel more you know, comfortable playing it and I, I make a lot more use of it. There's a big difference and and I love the direction that it's going. I can feel that it's constantly being developed and there's like username and everything. You, you can keep track of the cards that you've played and you can go back and review it and see all the side effects and all the indications for it. So yeah, there's definitely been a lot of improvement and um, I love to see what other new things we developed for this big game. Uh, definitely is a lot harder, but it helps with the recalling and the recalling of old drugs that maybe you haven't learned before or maybe you've forgotten. And I think that's probably the main difference for me, which is in third year, there's a bunch of different systems that I haven't reviewed recently or that I might have forgotten. And I think that helps with definitely the recalling of the drugs. Farmatch is a big help and um, I, I recommend it to a lot of my friends. You know, when, when I talk to them and I, I ask if they've been playing Farmatch, and, so, and you know, so, some of them ha have, have never even played that game, and I just feel like they're missing out big time because it's, it's a very helpful tool in studying. One of the best things about this game is just how often you can play it and how little effort you need in order to play it and that makes reviewing and, and going over the same content again so much easier and so I think that's probably for me the most helpful reason for why uh, Pharmatch has, has helped me in, in pharmacology. Uh, pharmacology is something that you have to constantly learn because you can't forget the previous drugs you learned so it's very good that this um, this game has like a shuffle mode that you can shuffle all the systems all the drugs from different systems and it's very helpful when you study for for example NL or like um, exams that requires you to remember everything you learned so and also the, the format is very cute so I recommend it to everyone essentially that that have to study pharmacology and it, it definitely takes away the stress of studying and the earlier you play the more you'll be like competitive and like feel fun while playing it so I definitely recommend it to everyone yes